Hey everyone, welcome to another lesson here at THSS Technology. Today we're going to have a quick little lesson on Unity and how to use tile maps inside of Unity. Now, quick little note, my OBS isn't uh, isn't playing too nice with Unity today, so it's going to be a little bit of lag, input lag from time to time, so my apologies for that. So first thing I'm going to do is I got my tile map down here in my sprites folder, and I'm going to go over to the inspector, and I'm going to change a few settings over here. We're going to change the sprite mode to multiple, we're going to change the pixels per unit to 32 because that's the size I designed mine. Yours might be 16 by 16 or 64 by 64. We're going to change the filter mode to no filter. And then we're going to change the compression to none. Okay, now I'm going to click apply. And now I'm going to go to my sprite editor. Okay, inside my sprite editor, I'm going to click on the second of these down arrows here called slice. You can make your window bigger if needed. I'm going to slice by cell size and 32 by 32. But like I said, those numbers might be different on your computer. So we're going to click slice, apply, and we're going to close this down. Next step, we're going to go over to the hierarchy here. We're going to right click. We're going to go to 2D object, and we are going to make a rectangular tile map. You can give it a name. I'm going to call mine ground zero one. You could call yours whatever you like. And now we're going to open up the tile palette. I'm going to take my tile palette window here. I'm going to dock it next to the inspector. Still have my inspector, have my tile palette. Now we're going to click where it says no valid palette. We're going to open that up. We're going to create a new palette. You can just give it a name as well. Call mine ground zero one again. We're going to click create. Select the folder by default. It'll put it right into our sprites folder. Grab our tiles, drag it in, and select the folder one more time. And now we have uh, our tiles here on the left. And now we can just start painting. So I can do a click and drag box and, uh, and paint a base grass, grass layer and add a few extra uh, details to that. And we can start painting our roads out if we like. Perfect. Uh, well, that's all we're going to do today. And uh, we will see you later.